So you wanna be a property manager, but you don't know, hey, what degree do I need to be a property manager? I've got you covered right here because there's a ton of misinformation going around and a ton of people just like you that waste a bunch of time and money, whether it's an online or a traditional university degree because they wanna be a property manager. And guess what? They didn't need that degree. What's up, everybody? My name is Matt Easton. I'm the founder of Leasing University. It's the number one certification, different than a degree, that people get in order to work in property management, that people get to become a property manager. But let me just level set the playing field for you right now. You do not need a degree to be a property manager, okay? Although having a university or traditional four-year degree might help in the interview process, not that much. Uh, might make you look good in the interview process, not gonna get you the job. You don't need to have a degree. Let me talk to you about why. In real estate, both commercial and multifamily, multifamily is apartments, that's, if I was looking to work as a property manager, I would want to go on the residential, the multifamily side. It has less of the ups and downs of commercial and the ability for you to make big time money in that field is huge. If you've got a degree, although it's going to look good on your resume, here's the thing. It's kind of a chicken and an egg situation with property management and property managers. If I'm investing $100 million, $200 million, $300 million in a piece of property, in a multifamily asset, let's say it's a 500 unit luxury community uh, property that I spent $350 million on, you having a degree is going to look advantageous in the job interview, but what I really want to know is do you have the skills? Can you come into this job? And in terms of skills, the two skills that I'm going to be looking for more than anything else is do you have the ability to work with prospects? Do you have the ability to answer the phone, to answer their questions, to close the lease? on them living at my community. Can you do that? Can you prove to me that you've had the training, that you have the skills to do that, okay? The second piece that I want is can you prove to me that you have the skill set, the ability to keep current renters at the property, okay? If you can bring people to the property and you can show me that you can do that and you can keep those people, we don't have a revolving door policy, where every 12 months that person moves out and we've got a what we call turn the unit which is very expensive for the property owner or landlord if i don't have to turn the unit and i can keep those residents i can keep those renters in the property you're somebody i want to hire and you're somebody that i will pay a ton of money to have working for me so what degree can prove that there isn't one they don't teach that in college. Even when you get your broker's license, which you don't need a broker's license to work for a property management company, misinformation, you don't need it. You need a broker's license if you're gonna start your own business. But if you're gonna work for a property management company, if you're gonna work as a property manager, you don't need a license. But even if I had a license, they don't teach you the sales skill sets, okay? So if I was looking for a job, if I was you, I would want to be able to prove that in an interview. Hey, based on my understanding of your current situation, you're looking for somebody that can come in, that can take that inbound traffic, that can take those leads that are calling the property and convert those into leases. You're also looking for somebody that's got the skill set to keep our current tenants, to keep our current residents living here and renewing their lease. Based on my understanding and based on the fact that I have my CLC credential, I believe I've got all of the skills that you need in this position. Does it make sense to put me in the role? When you've got a certification like we give you over at leasinguniversity.com, by the way, you can get it in less than 30 days. If you apply yourself, you can get it in two weeks. It's 14 hours worth of video training. You're gonna have your CLC credential. If you would like, I would also write a letter of recommendation for you. You can list me as a reference on your job interviews. That's the kind of credibility that you need if you're looking to become a property manager. Of course, having a four-year college degree is gonna look nice on your resume, but you really need somebody like me 
going to bat for you and saying, hey, you need to hire them. They're sharp as a tack. They're certified. They understand the sales process. If you don't put them in the role of property manager for your asset, they're going to be working for your competition across the street and they're going to take all of your residents and tenants. That's the kind of credibility that you need. If you're interested in learning more about how we can get you certified for $299 over at leasinguniversity.com, give our offices a call. My people are in a hurry to help you. They will answer any questions you have. If you want to talk to me personally, my name is Matt Easton. Just call our headquarters at 888-735-7451. Our credential is going to put you in the best position to make the money that you need to make and to have the career in property management that you want to have. I'll see you over at leasinguniversity.com.